Animal slaughtering in St. Lucia occurs on a weekly basis in abattoirs at various locations around the island. The process is guided by regulations and procedures which are implemented and monitored by various agencies of government. These processes are essential to ensure product and service quality to the general public. In keeping with tradition, abattoirs are busier during the month of December as more persons look to purchase locally produced meat for their Christmas menus. As a result, the Ministry of Health, Wellness and Elderly Affairs joins forces with the Ministry of Agriculture to ensure best practices are observed during this time in the interest of food safety. Environmental Health Officer Simentha Tiso speaks about some of the guidelines that must be adhered to when operating a slaughterhouse. To operate a slaughterhouse, butchers must ensure the following. Running water, concrete slab, waste and waste water management, hand washing facility with soap. Good personal hygiene must also be observed. Proper hair covering, butchers helpers should dress appropriately and have valid health certificates. No smoking or eating while handling meats and meat products. Jewelry should not be worn during slaughtering. Tiso says meat and meat products will be inspected and butchers who fail to follow the set procedures risk losing their products. Upon inspection, once the meat receives a passing grade, it is stamped and approved for sale. Live animals will be tagged by the Ministry of Agriculture and must be approved 24 hours before slaughter and repeated if the slaughter is delayed for more than a day. The major objectives of anti-mortem inspection are as follows. To screen all animals destined to slaughter, to ensure that animals are properly rested and are treated humanely, to ensure that proper clinical information which will assist in disease diagnosis and judgment is obtained, to reduce contamination of carcasses by extraneous matter, to identify re reportable animal diseases, to prevent sick, pregnant, and those treated with antibiotics, chemotherapeutic agents, insecticides, and pesticides from slaughter. Philippe says the process must include a full examination of the animal, both in rest and in motion, behavior, Nutritional status, cleanliness, signs of disease, and abnormalities are all key checkpoints during the examination. Some of the abnormalities which are checked on, ex on examination include respiration, behavior, gait, posture, structure and conformation, discharges and, or, and protrusions from orifices, skin and mucosa color, and odor. Inspectors anti-mortem judgment must be performed at the admission of animals. Animals showing signs of diseases should be held for further exa veterinary examination. A butcher must be registered with the Ministry of Health in order to slaughter and sell meat and meat products. Registration is currently ongoing at Environmental Health Department offices located at Boisdouage, Viewfort and Soufre and will end on December 22, 2022. For the Ministry of Health, Wellness and Elderly Affairs, I'm Sant Justin.